What is happening, guys? Call of Duty Black Ops Kid here, coming at you with Odd World Soulstorm information. It's been a while, and uh, we finally got the re reveal date for Odd World Soulstorm. It's on their YouTube channel. They put it during the Game Awards, and I will say, spoiler alert, it's coming out next year. I mean, we already kind of figured that, and my sources were correct. Um, April is when it's coming out, so let's go ahead and watch the gameplay trailer as a whole. I actually have not seen the gameplay, but this looks fucking sweet. Not going to lie. This game this got, looks like it's gotten increasingly better. Woo, what the fuck was that? Hold on. I got to I got to Dude, that thing the fucking uh the fucking Gluckins look so sick, bro. Holy shit. Just wanted to point that out. This is fucking sweet, bro. It's got a fucking flashlight. This game is definitely going to be worth the wait, though. 100%. So, spring of 2021. So, April is basically what it is. It's saying Epic Game Store, PS5, and PS4. So, it's probably going to be coming... With the launch date of PlayStation 5 with the Epic Game Store. So I'll be playing it on PC around April. That's epic news. <laughs> That's really... I mean, wow, that was no pun intended. But, um, so let's break down a couple things within the trailer that I, I noticed when I was looking through here. Is, obviously, there's this little statue here with Abe's on it with a little handprint. That is one thing I want to notice when we go through the rest of these things. There's also a slig here. There's the little hawk things from gameplays ago. These things kind of remind me of the um, the Elam trials when we were unlocking those back in New, uh, Oddworld New and Tasty. Um, and there seemed to be some sort of activation. This is like a factory back here because um, there's an activation on this right-hand side right here and there's i don't know what this entails maybe it opens up something something runs out I'm not really sure um this is a totally new reimagining of exodus as well a lot of people keep asking me what's wrong with this you can see that there's mudakins in here as well being put through the things to get tears probably for the soul storm brew and um yeah i have to pause this again dude this is absolutely insane dude like this looks way better than I imagined. I did not think they could pull off it looking this good uh, for the Gluckins. They look phenomenal, I will say. The hype train has been increased now that we actually have an official date. Now we're just kind of like twirling our thumbs just like saying, when are we going to get Oddworld's gameplay? And now we finally know for sure. So he looks cool as hell. This is during a cutscene, obviously, not in-game content. I want to say that. Um, Abe with teeth. Still pretty damn weird, I would say. Cutting his stitches still looks different, uh, but he looks cool. Um, we do see employees, casualties, escapees, and security. 16, we do remember that the we do get bad karma for killing um, Sligs as well. As far as I'm aware, there was no gameplay shown. There was just literally the trailer. This right here, there is a boulder behind him in a Indiana Jones-like style with a flashlight. Pretty cool. Because this is a dark section, you probably can't see very well. So you're bound to have some cool gadgets to help you along the way. Obviously, we knew we could possess flying sligs. That was something that I think was going to happen in Exodus. I don't remember if it did happen in Exodus. It's been so damn long. But um, pretty damn cool. Uh, visually, this is a cool 2.5 shot where it comes around Abe and there's sligs shooting at him. I thought that was pretty cool. And the backdrop is in the Necri Mines, I'm going to assume, or whatever they decided to change it to. Still pretty damn cool. Here we have Abe having a beam shot down at him, whether he's changing to a special form or blowing up all the things around him. Doesn't really say. He's shocking that stuff, taking control of a slig. We got some more of this train mission, which we've had only a million gameplays of. Uh, there are some spikes coming out of there. This is a pretty cool shot. I've never seen this one. Look at the backdrop in here. 
there's a freaking you can see literally where you're going to go press that button. Lori Lanning has described this game as if you can see it in the background, you can go to that spot. Um, well, for the most part, I think Todd Howard also said the same thing about Skyrim. So, uh, motion blur out the ass. Whoops. And, um, flying slicks from the trailers that we've seen before. There's, they're reusing a lot of gameplay, which is not a good sign. They should have showed off as much as they possibly can. Destructible environments. This is something that's cool. Rapture farm meat products. Vikers labs. Uh, this is making a return. That's obviously something we already knew. Something I did want to point out. We'd not really had any Vikers Lab airships inside there. I'm also making this at 3 in the morning. Just wanted to specify that. We have the cool, ashy, Larry-looking <laughs> Mutak in here. Uh, priestess um, looking pretty... Or Priest, sorry. No Priestess. No uh, female Madakins as far as we know in this game. This cutscene has always intrigued me to see what's going on here. A falling mine climbs up you have alf going crazy and we have release date for soul storm um this is phenomenal news we finally have a release date we broke down the 45 second trailer which actually had a lot to, to show honestly and i'm glad that you are able to play this on ps4 or ps5 obviously if you magically got a ps5 sometime soon hopefully no scalping prices um, you got a pretty decent deal in selection on your, uh, you have a pretty good game coming out for this, this year. And, um, obviously I'll probably be playing it, unfortunately on the Epic game store because it comes only exclusively. Um, they did only create this game with 30 people. So I'm fine with paying Epic. Unfortunately, if you can get it on PlayStation, play, uh, play it on PlayStation. I might be playing it on PlayStation, four but then i'm like if i have a pc either way we'll probably be playing an epic game store uh no official date but it is in spring this is the most polished and best gameplay we've seen so i guarantee it should come out around this time uh they did say that they do not expect any delays but th this time they actually have a month or some sort of briefing attached to it a quarter one of 2021 um, 2021 is already looking better than 2020 in this regard. So, um, guys, let me know what you guys think about, uh, Ottawa Soulstorm finally happening. Um, I know a lot of people were showing, uh, distress for what was going on in Oddworld Soulstorm. So let me know what you guys are thinking about now that you've seen that we actually have a release date. Um, and we've seen some more gameplay and some other cool stuff like that. So just let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Subscribe for more Oddworld Soulstorm news and a gameplay or uh, and a walkthrough when the game comes out. We just did Cyberpunk, and boy, that was tiring. Uh, we did a 12-hour live stream, then an 8-hour, and then a 3-hour, uh, three 3- three or 4-hour to finish her up. So, guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more great Oddworld Soulstorm content. Blah, 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 blah. I'm tired. It's 4 o'clock in the morning. Guys, thanks for watching. See you later.